Genomic testing has dramatically changed ram selection for South Australian sheep breeder Dale Price. As a result of research by the Sheep CRC on the industry's resource flock, new DNA-based research breeding values are allowing producers to identify breeding stock at a much younger age which carry superior genes for a range of traits including meat eating quality. For Dale, the additional information that DNA testing provides has also shown some rams that he otherwise would have selected for joining to be carrying unwanted genetic traits. With terminals, uh, the level of ASPVs, uh, particularly in the, the growth, uh, fat and, and uh, other main traits, is really good and we've uh, traditionally used uh, young ram lambs uh, as part of our uh, breeding program which has reduced the generational gap and so we were looking for RBVs, uh, particularly for meat eating quality. Uh, both to select and improve the sheep that we're using but also to avoid uh, using sheep that will send us down the wrong track because ultimately lamb is a premium product we want to maintain that and also to uh, ensure that happens we actually need to ensure that the consumer gets the best tasting experience every time they buy lamb. Mr Price runs Majada Pole Dorsets, part of the Meat Elite group of studs and has been participating in commercial application trials of DNA technology conducted by the Sheep CRC. This year the group DNA tested 188 rams out of a total of 2,500 put up for possible selection and ended up with a team of just 14 young rams that were the star performers in specific traits while at the same time maintaining genetic diversity. We now have the information to select for intramuscular fats, uh, sheer force and lean meat yield in particular. Uh, we'll be able to balance those traits in the ways that we want and but also monitor ha if uh, they have any impact on the ASPVs that are existing. We want to protect uh, the growth fat and, uh, and uh, leanness that we currently have. Uh, and continue to promote that. Uh, the new genomics test will allow us to make those selections earlier and if uh, we will give us far greater accuracy in terms of using size uh, repeatedly. Mr Price says the use of objective selection tools such as ASBVs and genomic testing has resulted in extremely positive feedback from commercial clients. The feedback from our clients is that their uh, product in terms of uh, prime lamb are far more consistent uh, in shape, uh, carcass quality. They are turning the sheep off at a younger age for the same weight. Uh, and if we look at uh, worm resistance, we're finding that we are able to drench sheep less often. Sheep CRC genomics research team leader, Professor Julius van der Werf, says genomic testing is particularly useful when looking at hard to measure traits things that can only be measured late in an animal's life or after they've been slaughtered. So genomic testing means that based on a DNA test uh, you want to predict uh, an animal's potential uh, for, <coughs> for productivity and you want to predict its breeding value and uh, it's, it's a big step forward uh, compared with what we did before. For those difficult to measure traits we will do a lot better. And so in, for, the, for the terminal sire breeds in sheep, that means that you can select better on carcass quality. Uh, in merino, we can select better on lifetime production, like uh, adult wool production and also reproductive rate. A new 12K DNA test has been made available to mainstream sheep producers at a cost of just $50. The new test carries equivalent levels of accuracy to the larger tests used in the sheep CRC's pilot projects, but at half the price.